Summer is the season for outdoor fun. That often means spending time at the grill, especially this weekend since the holidays here. To put a twist on what to serve up at your barbecue, celebrity chef and four-time cookbook author Jamie Quinn. Good morning, chef. Hey, good morning, Mary. Thank you for having me. Happy summer to you. Are you planning to grill and chill for the long weekend? Uh, absolutely. My husband loves to grill. I love to okay. eat what he <laughs> creates. Um, but you bring us a more balanced approach to our traditional barbecue. What do you have? Yeah, trying to think a little lean and clean for bathing suit season, mm -hmm. although I love to eat like you, so we are definitely good friends. Mm -hmm. uh, because there's something to me that, you know, there's something brilliant about a backyard barbecue and summer. Um, but I think we do need to think everything in moderation. So I took my best healthful ideas, I teamed up with some great companies, and I wanted to bring you my best summer tips. So. First and foremost, it is easy to rack up calories from drinks and beverages. We all know that. And it's easy to be tempted. But I like to set out a buffet like this that looks so decadently delicious you can't help yourself, but it's still lean and clean and healthful. So first and foremost, when everyone walks in, they're thirsty. I set out a galvanized bucket, and I will tell you that uh, the calories cannot add up from drinks, but you do not have to sacrifice taste. I like working with Coca-Cola because they have a variety of beverages that everyone loves. I happen to love the Coca-Cola mini can. Mm -hmm. Seven and a half ounces, 90 calories, portion controlled. It doesn't get any better than that. You still get what you love, but you're still conscious of it, right? So I set it out with a bunch of ice and everybody's happy. And then moving on, Mary, then everybody gets hungry, right? Mm -hmm. Snack attack. But your husband is at the grill. Mm -hmm. Everything's not ready yet. What do you do? Well, I love this idea. It's interactive. It gets everyone involved. And it's totally personalized. I never met anybody that didn't like popcorn. So I set out a popcorn bar, and I do it year round, but I especially like it during the summer because it does satiate and fill you up. It's high in fiber and naturally low in calories and fat. And I set out seasonings like the barbecue rub that you're using on the grill Ooh. or ranch powder or mm -hmm. you know ranch dressing powder or lime powder, all the add-ins. Then I put out these little paper bags, and I let everybody or I encourage everyone to toss their favorite popcorn flavor, and it adds really fabulous flavor and it's delicious and it's fun, right? Well, I think for kids especially because, you know, we've got a lot of little ones in our family yes. and finding something that the moms and dads <laughs> and the teens and the youngest that everybody can have some fun with and personalize, I think that's smart. I agree. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, no, I think it's a great idea, uh -huh. kids and adults alike, um, or for the kid in all of us. And then I wrote uh, some very specific recipes that I've shared at ChefJamie.com uh -huh. for a lean and clean summer, like a sweet and spicy slaw. If you've never grilled cabbage before, it adds smoky, oh, fabulous wow. flavor to your coleslaw. I have an Asian grilled pork tenderloin that I like to put in a lettuce wrap. And then here's a really, I think, important message when it comes to summer and for great cooks is that not everything has to come off the grill. It's nice to have some side dishes made in advance. So I encourage you to remember my favorite appliance, especially during the summer, and that is my Tiger rice cooker. They make the best multifunction rice cookers. I am a Tiger fan. But what I love, too, is that this pearl couscous salad with two tomatoes, basil, and I added feta cheese for that sort of salty flavor made in advance and cooked in my rice cooker. Mm -hmm. Doesn't add any heat to the ambient, uh, to the kitchen though, you know, ambient heat. You're not firing up the stove or the mm -hmm. oven. I use my rice cooker year round, but I think it's a great tip to remind great cooks that this is your go-to versatile cook it all, you know, uh, help you out for summer appliance. And then don't forget, Mary, when you're serving uh, watermelon this summer, a pinch of salt mm -hmm. brings out all that sweetness. My best chef's tip. Great to know. And the website with more recipes? Of course, recipes and inspiration served up daily at chefjamie.com. Sounds good. We'll leave it there. Chef Gwen, thanks for joining us and happy 4th of July. Thank you for having me. Thank, Thank you, Mary. You. Happy summer to you. Thank you, Mike.